Thank you, Nancy. This was a slaughter. The Brooklyn Nets dominate the Golden State Warriors from start to finish. Nets got another strong effort from Karis LeVert. Everybody really was involved yep. in some form or fashion for Kenny Atkinson's squad. I, I think what was most impressive, too, was the way in which they set the tone out of the gates yep. and finished it throughout the duration of the game. And you said it. Karis LeVert had a big game. We saw 29 assists. It was the ball sharing, the movement, everything that you want to do against a lesser opponent who's missing some pieces. They got done. And it was more about the Brooklyn Nets, how they wanted to con continue to get themselves back on track. And we saw a whole lot of that throughout the, the whole game and it, it, that sustained effort is something that I think that they can build on now as they've got a tough couple games before the All-Star break. Yeah, no doubt. With the Toronto Raptors on the schedule, the Pacers, then the Raptors again, then the All-Star break hits. Let's recognize how important this stretch is. Uh, not just for the standings, but just how they're being viewed around the NBA. Uh, I think the Nets completely realize that they're not yet at that stage where the rest of the league fears them. There's still that process of figuring out exactly who they are and what they are. And then obviously the Kyrie Irving news is going to play a role in that moving forward once they check on that knee and how he's coming along. And I think that's a big part of it. This team has dealt with so many injuries throughout the, the course yeah. of the season. We think about Kyrie Irving missing those 26 games with the shoulder. Karis LeVert 25 games with the thumb. There's been a handful of other players who've missed games here and there and now Kyrie Irving again. So they've never really been holding in the same time and yeah. I, I think for this Nets team they understand that's a part of it but more than anything they just want to have a sense of, of a stability and I think right now we've seen that even though it's been against some opponents that don't have winning records they're starting to put those pieces together and so now it's, it's going to be you know a, a challenging stretch here in the next three games but we know as soon as they come out of the all-star break yeah. it's like a sprint until the finish and so I think for the Nets they want to make sure to really solidify themselves in that playoff position where they are in the Eastern Conference standings and a big part of that is just how they feel both on the floor in their performance but also in the locker room we see a lot of smiles yeah. and a lot of laughter and over the course of the season you need to have some of these the Nets have not had a whole lot of blowout wins where they can exhale where they can laugh have some fun on the bench and know that you've taken care of business early in the evening and for the Nets uh, this is a game that you circle on your schedule. They'd lost eight straight to the Golden State Warriors. It's not the same team as we know without Steph Curry, without Klay Thompson, with Kevin Durant now in Brooklyn. But you have to win. That's how these games line up. You're supposed to win, and... You have to go get it done. And they've had some experience throughout the course of the season. You think about being up at Minnesota yeah. when there was a lot of players filling in the gaps and it didn't go the way the Nets had expected. So it's not a given. Anytime you were up against a NBA team, you know there are professionals on the other side. And that's where I think, you know, the amount of respect and the appropriate fear that they had for the opponent coming yeah. out of the gates, understanding D'Angelo Russell was going to be coming back, making his return, the type of numbers and points he could put up. And I think just the fact that this team had the maturity and the composure to be locked in from the beginning says a lot about where they are getting to as a group as a whole largest disparity of the season the nets win it by 41 points over the warriors they snap that eight game streak in the loss column against golden state